పరిప చమంది నా దిస్ చమంది గోస్ వెరీ వెల్ విత్ రైస్ హాట్ రైస్ అండ్ యూ జస్ట్ పోర్ దిస్ అండ్ మిక్స్ ఇట్ వెరీ వెల్ అండ్ హ్యాప్ యూ విల్ రియలీ లవ్ దిస్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ ద నటీనెస్ ఆఫ్ దాట్ ద కోర్స్లీ పౌడర్డ్ for the dals that what we have powdered it and uh, we have grinded right not that uh, paste like we have grinded so when each mouth when you take the dal what we have fried it tends to give you a nice bite and then the sourness of the tamarind and the hing everything together it, it all put together it tastes really good but you should have hot rice to mix and have this is one of the recipe what mom used to make for us when we were uh, very young itself and uh, if someone is ill in the house and you want to have a porridge that is a kanji with it this is with chutta papadam and kanji and this is one of the best combinations that you can have hey foodies hi i hope you're all doing well today i'm going to do parupu chamandi parupu means that's the dolls <coughs> this is a kind of a chamandi or a powder or a chutney like what you can call it's a thick uh, grounded chutney like so the ingredients needed for this are half a cup of tur dal okay quarter cup of urad dal quarter cup of the coriander seeds few bunches of the curry leaves hing i need one big size tamarind now the tamarind and the chili is for the entire taste for this uh, chutney or the chamandi we call it as okay now uh, there should be enough of tamarind and enough of red chili these two only lift the taste of this ch- chamandi you cannot have less tamarind and without spice it won't be nice it'll be just like dal's grounded and kept like okay then i need some oil and of course need some salt to complete this chamandi now first what i'm going to do is we will have to fry individually everything because all of them have a different kind of frying timing for example tur dal something takes different time than the urad dal from urad dal to the uh, uh, coriander seed it's got different level of the frying sp- time so what i will do is i will add little oil fry tur dal then i will again add little uh, remove it and keep aside then again i will add oil fry the urad dal then the, individually like that i'm going to fry each one by one and then i will show you and then when you're frying each one has to be nice red color I'm frying this one See the color of the dal has changed completely now. I'm going to take it out. You can just take and put it in a plate all together, no problem. But only frying is different. I've added the urad the same way I'm frying it out. See the urad also is fried very well now. So I'm going to take it out. Frying the coriander seed. along with the curry leaves after the coriander seeds is done little bit i will add the red chili also to it i'm taking out the rest of the ingredients also so i'm done with all frying now add all the dal into this uh, mixer and uh, i've added some hing to it i'm going to add salt also to it and then i'm going to first powder this uh, coarsely and then uh, probably one pulse i will do and then i will show you what i how it looks this is a consistency what i have powdered how do i show you all yeah see coarse i'll add some water and run it one more time i have grounded that chamandi 